I have not watched uh, the uh, Owen Hart uh, falling from the rafters. Is, that's got to be the not going to watch that. The I want toughest moment of your career. Yeah, hard, really hard. The that was a night, and because he was such not just he was such a beloved guy. Yeah, well, legit. Didn't have an enemy in the world. Really talented guy, but if he had no talent, it wouldn't have mattered. He was a really beloved guy. Uh, so we're we're doing, you know, he falls. We have the medical crew help. We're scrambling around. They're doing video packages, this, that, and the other. And we finally get the medical people get him, uh, you know, taken to the hospital. And of course, obviously, you know, he does make it. He dies. Uh, and then we're. Uh, uh, Did you see him? Yeah. And you knew, like, it wasn't like you looked up, like, hey, what happened? I saw him. I was, the monitors were, like, right here, right? Yeah. So I, I'm, a, I, my eyes are up, and he came into my peripheral vision. He came into my screen, this, this body, this uh, uh, flash. Yeah. Boom. And I saw his body hit the ring post or the ring, or, or, or I couldn't quite sure. And then uh, Lawler. Uh, gets up and runs over there. Yeah. And people come out the ring and Jerry's there and Jerry comes back to me and he shakes his head like he's not going to make it. Oh. And uh, I, I'm thinking, you know, well, you know, maybe King's just got a flair for the dramatic and mm -hmm. he's he's going to be all right. Or maybe he's broken his back or, you know, that's horrible, but I mean, it's better than death. So uh, they get him out, take him away. I think we have another match. So we're trying to refocus, and the crowd's mur you know the murmur, and nobody know this this kill the crowd. Uh, not a good term. And uh, so they they come on the truck. They say, "Hey Jr., when uh, uh, we come back, you need to give uh, an update on Owen." Yeah. And I, so I hit my talk back button. To the, Kevin Dunn was in the truck. He's the executive producer now. He was. He was I think he's executive producer then. Uh, but he was talking to us because Vince was off headsets. He was, everybody was trying to figure out, you know, get medical people yeah, yeah, and yeah. get everybody. It was chaotic back there, obviously. And uh, so Kevin comes on and says, uh, this later in the night, he said, you, JR, we're going to come back and do it on camera, you and King, and you need to give an update on Owen. Kevin had thought, I think, to this day, that Kevin thought that Vince had told me what the update was. Oh. So I hit the talk back button. In, while we're in a video package, I said, Kevin, I don't know what the update is. Here, the quick, here, the, comes back and says, J.R. Owen's dead. And you're back in 10, 9. So I got like 10 seconds to say, what are you going to say? How are you going to? Well, all I heard it too. Yeah. So we're looking at each other like, oh, God, we're going to do it on camera. we got to make this announcement. So the, that was no preparation. Uh, and I tried to, there's where you kind of break that fourth wall and you say, this is not a part of the show. Yeah. I didn't know what to say. Like, Hey, all this other stuff you've been seeing is a fake. Yeah. Uh, but what you just, but, but, a one of our, one of the most beloved people that we know has died. Whatever. I, I don't even know what I said. So I, I've had, I've had various people say, well, when are you going to write your book? You know, when are you going to write this, this, you know, taking you through the wild west, sex, drugs, and rock and roll, the seventies, all the way through corporate wrestling and mm -hmm. all that, pay-per-view, satellite, cable, blah, blah, blah. And I said, I don't know. I said, well, we really want to know your feelings on the night that Owen Hart died. Publishers, book people, book agents. I said, I don't know how I feel about that because I've never watched it. That's, that happened in 99. Yeah. I've never seen it. So the only time that I resign myself that I will watch it if, is if I do a book so that I can accurately write about it. And reflect. And, and give it justice. Now, and so just brush over it. Was there any moment? I don't even know if you were able to process what had just happened while you were sitting there. Mm. But is there any moment where you go, "I'm not gonna"? What do you mean? Can we're continuing the show? Or are you saying, I, "Yeah, that's what we do. We continue." I want to tell show. you. I I think I was in my 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 ass was in shock. So uh, you're running autopilot. Oh, yeah. Just you you're. Uh, well, you know, you, you got a guy that works works with you, that you know you're you know his family, you, you know his kids, mm -hmm. you met his you know you know his wife, you, you met his dad, been in their, been in her home, yeah, 
Uh, your dad's home. Back again to uh, talking and, about these people, not yeah, not wrestlers, not yeah, characters, but people you know, human beings that they're, you, yeah, yeah, exactly. you know, their family. And uh, so I think that we were, I think we we're just going with that whole thing and and auto autopilot and in shock. The I remember being so conflicted in the in the hotel room alone. Yeah, when the show was over. Wondering we, if you had done the right thing or not. Yeah, and, and how could it have been prevented? And, yeah. and how's the family going to take it? And or how 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 have they? How's this information been disseminated? Uh, you know, and the children of his Owen's two young children, and and he had you know he's got a big he's tons of brothers and sisters. I think there are twelve of them. Yeah, all together. You know, and so it affected all them and all their children. The mom and dad were alive, mm -hmm. so they got to bury their youngest son. Right. It was just hor horrible. See, all those flood of emotions are going through. You're sitting in a room by yourself at a hotel someplace. Yeah. And here, and then the thing that hit, hits your head is that, oh, yeah, and by the way, we've got to do Monday Night Raw in a few hours. And we've got to address this. Yeah. So it became that Owen Hart tribute show, mm -hmm. and it was very emotional. And so you had to relive everything all over again, all the emotions. <laughs>